Oh. Ah, uh, Rita. Yeah. Mr. Castle, Miss Shifton, it's a pleasure to meet both of you. I'm Mason Wood. What a pleasure. I cannot even believe I'm here. This is a dream come true. That's very kind of you to say. Our society has a long and rich history, and our membership spans every continent save Antarctica. Not too many murders there. No, no. <laughs> Although I did find a lost Chinese treasure ship hidden in an iceberg 2007. Now, I hate to do this, but I need to speak to Mr. Castle alone. I'm sure you understand, Miss Shipton. No. I can stay here if that's what you mean. Excellent. This way. As you can see, we have assembled a few of our members. Hi. 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 I know you. You were at the crime scene. You're a cop. No, but I wear the hell out of a uniform. This is Kendall Frost. She's a private detective based out of San Francisco. I'm afraid I'm a little confused. What exactly are we doing here? Philip Harris was a member of our society. His death is a tragedy, but it is also an opportunity for you or Miss Frost. Philip's death has left an opening in our ranks. Whichever one of you solves his murder will be invited in. Thanks for coming in. Where's everyone else? Their enthusiasm for both of you waned after the way you conducted yourselves last night. It was messy, boorish, lacking the sophistication we expect from any potential member. It was Her his fault. fault. No. It was my fault for thinking that either of you could ever have filled Philip's shoes. Mr. Wood, please give me another chance. No, give me another chance. I will find Philip's killer. She won't. She's been two steps behind me this whole time. Behind you? I got to Austin first. And I got to the knife. And although it wasn't the actual murder weapon, thank you to my contacts, the NYPD, I have the address to the prop master's cousin in San Pedro who kept two of the last prop knives for himself as souvenirs. You see, I am close. Okay. And may the best detective win. Don't worry. I will. You realize she picked your pocket? Oh, yes. Whose address is on that piece of paper? It's a casting director my mother wanted to have a meeting with. Mm. Kendall is going to be mad when she finds out. Look, I'm scared of her. She is a master of Krav Maga. And she is deadly with a sniper rifle from a mile and a half. Good luck.